Hey everybody, welcome to the office. Uh, we are flying high over here after a great Blueprint Sunday. This has been mentioned, but I just want to make sure everybody on this email is up to speed. Blueprint Sunday is the last Sunday in September every single year. 2024 is already on the calendar, last Sunday of, uh, the se of, of every September. It is our chance to stop, look back over the last 12 months, celebrate everything that God has done, look out at the next 12 in terms of vision, and align ourselves with where we sense he would like us to go next. No house, the church is a house, spiritual house. No house gets built without a blueprint. So uh, in this case, we want it to be designed by God and not ourselves. So it is our annual pause, reflect, celebrate. It's our church birthday. Our church was uh, founded in September of 2021. So it was also our second birthday. So we had our second birthday this weekend. Uh, we had an incredible turnout. We had an awesome time. Uh, we had a team from Alabama, uh, Shades Mountain Baptist Church, who's been supporting us for four years now, four, uh, bring uh, uh, a team of people up to help us pull off three events in 24 hours over the weekend. You know, we had the main church service, but then we also had some an event on Saturday night. We had a, a small dinner. And then on Sunday after church, we threw a barbecue block party. Um, Got to tell you a little background here. On Thursday or so, the weather, we saw this in the forecast, which is Tropical Storm Ophelia, which was going to park over us all weekend and rain on us, uh, which it did constantly. So we unfortunately had to move our, our, our after church barbecue on Sunday, which was a huge neighborhood outreach opportunity. We're going to have to move it inside, uh, which, and upstairs, you know, in the, in the school cafeteria where we used to meet up the street. So I was afraid our blog party was going to become a secret and nobody was going to come in. But uh, some of our team from Shades Mountain actually went out in the rain, made signs that said indoor blog party upstairs. And people came. <laughs> people came. Um, and I bet there were over 100 people. First time we've ever gathered that many people for a Mission City event ever. Um, and the, 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 the service was great. The after party was great. And uh, most importantly, um, we're looking forward to letting God continue to drive the dreams around here. It's kind of a tide is rising feeling, feels great. You know, sometimes in church planting, you have the, you know, the tide is uh, falling. <laughs> you know, there are some of those. This was a tide is rising moment that feels great. Uh, so many people who love us and support us were in town and so many others who um, love us and support us all the same could not make it in. So uh, wherever you are at, I just want you to know um, the things being invested in are bearing fruit. And um, we're just so thankful. Please go catch the message if you'd like uh, from uh, from Sunday. It's up on our podcast. Uh, get it wherever you get your podcast, and you'll hear kind of the spirit of what we were celebrating and going forward with um, in terms of vision. So we love you, and we thank you. That's all we can say. All right? Um, and make a plan now. The last Sunday in September, you're coming. Don't fly out on a Sunday because then it, it'll stress the whole day out, and you'll be at church, you know, thinking about where are your bags and all this. Fly out on a Monday, no sooner than a Monday, and come in over the weekend, have a great weekend out of it, and be with us to celebrate next year. Um, so anyway, it's going to be a thing. So love you all so much, and uh, yeah, thrilled to touch base with you.